Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. So today I'm starting my witchy haul. I think this is my first properly witch related video. I don't know. But anyway, I today I'm doing an Etsy witchcraft stuff haul. You saw the title of the video, you know what it's about, so it's okay. <laughs> so in this video I will be showing you things um, in different outfits because I'll be filming it over a multitude of days because I, I just can't, I can't open them with you because I'm, I like to open things. <laughs> so I'm going to show you what I've got today and then when I get more things in the post I will then come back and you'll see me in another outfit. Maybe I might just live in this jumper. So <laughs> we'll see. But anyway, so this is an Etsy witchcraft stuff haul. <laughs> ah, here are my seashells. I was looking for these. That wasn't from Etsy, I've had those shells for years. Anyway, so the first thing that I'm going to show you is... Oh, it's stunning. Uh, this was the quick, these were the two quickest things, I bought them both on the same day, which was probably... like Sunday. So yeah, today's Wednesday. I think I probably ordered them like Sunday and these came really quickly. I think everything I bought in this haul is from the UK, so everything should be turning up quite quickly. It just depends how long they are to make because obviously they are little brands, not brands, they're, you know, um, little shops, you know, and so supporting the little guys, not the big guys. So anyway, this is stunning. Oh, it's an athame. So an athame is a sort of ritual knife or yeah, a knife that you kind of use in spellcraft. Um, like you can use them to engrave sigils onto candles or anything like that really. Um, or for cutting the veil, which is so from, so if you do hedge witchery, um, it, well, you don't have to do hedge witchery to cut the veil. So it's like, so to cut through the barrier of the living world into the dead world. The veil is what's in between the living and the dead, essentially. So you can use it for many things and what you use it for is completely up to you as an individual witch. Um, it's um, symbolic of the fire sign. Um, and oh God, this one's beautiful. This is beautiful. Do you see it? Look. Look at the gloriousness. The some amethyst and some selenite and look at it guys it's gorgeous but yeah so we've got this nice spiral going on and in the selenite and we've got a nice point there <laughs> and we've got some we've got a bunch of amethyst oh look at this amethyst so what i'm going to do which i won't probably show you in this video is to cleanse it and to bond with it because obviously someone else made this so they're currently more bonded with it than i am and just in case it had a turbulent journey in the post, I need to cleanse it. And just so, <clears throat> and just so if there's any negative vibes on it, which I kind of doubt there is, but there could be some. So I'll give that a quick cleanse with maybe some incense, with some moon water, you know, check what crystals can be, you know, in water. I mean, I'm not going to be putting it in water, just a little scrub down with some moon water, maybe and some incense. Stunning! Oh, I l oh, look at that! Look at that! Fuck yeah! So I've only got two things today, and here's another thing. So these, so now this is by Midnight Imperium. So thank you. And what we've got, some little candle holders they're so cute i haven't actually looked at these guys today yet i've only looked at the athem because i was just super super excited for the athem but yes we've got some little candle holders so they hold little candles and i have so often little can you use like a very type a very specific kind of little you can use any candle for witchcraft but often you get like just these little thin ones um and i've only got holders for big ones so yeah so we've got a star and a pentagram or a pentacle, whatever you want to call it. Um, I'm going to call it a pentagram. So yeah, it's like a star simply because it's just a star and then a pentagram just in case I want, um, you know, to put things around it, you know, 
so depending on what I need, I got two. Um, and yeah, they were, they were only like, they were really cheap, you know. And the Athlean was a really good price as well. Um, but yes, that's all I've got today and I will see you when I have new things. So, I have more today. So this is from The Charmed Hair. Look at this lovely little card. I love hairs. I'm thinking about getting a tattoo of her hair. Uh. So this is a bunch of charms, um, like little, you know, bracelet charms sort of thing. You know, like these guys. So yes, let's open it up. Look at this pretty packaging first though. That's so pretty. Right. Yes, some different clothing today, different place we're by my altar today. So I realised this is quite a nice spot to film in. Wow. Jenny. This is from Jenny at The Charmed Hair. She knows how to wrap. I need to learn Christmas wrapping methods off her because I bet her parents and family and friends get really nicely wrapped things because, wow. I'm just moving my... Hunger cord. <laughs> wow. So here we have the a sun, a little owl, a tree, a woman holding, I don't know, tentacle, an otter? No, a cat. So what I'm going to use these for is for divination purposes so like you have them in a bag and then you chuck a few and then you see what comes up oh my god look at this tiny little chalice it's so cute that is so cute I've got the sun and the moon I've got a spiral got a f oh that's um like the green man I've got a Dear, I've got a lot. We've got a dog wolf. We've got another sun. We've got a nice little. Oh, that's a really nice mushroom. That is so cool. I'll be very good for hard work. We've got a fox. Oh wow, it's a double-sided crow. So as in, like, it's not flat. It's double-sided. Oh, that's really nice. That's like a crow, raven, that sort of thing. We've got a. Oh, that's really pretty. You know what? I think I might want a tattoo of that. That is so pretty. Oh, wow. That's gorgeous. A little pumpkin. See, there's just a lot there. We've got the Celtic three knot. We've got a hair. I love hair so much. Another owl. We've got a frog. And a witch's hat. Oh, that's so cute because, you know, so they're all beads. So you're meant to put. So you can put them on jewelry. But, like,. It doesn't have a hoop because the hat is the hoop. I love it. Wow. Like as there's another pentacle here, I might make you know if there like as there are like some doubles. Like there's a pentacle here and there's a pentacle here. I might use the big one to make some jewelry. I might use that in like some jewelry that I might make for myself. Got a feather. Oh, that's so pretty. That's so pretty. Wow. But yeah. Nice, 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 nice. They were expensive, these beads, but I've now seen them. I'm like, not completely worth it. Cause like, they were like, like the price I've, this is the price of them. Here's the page, identity page of them on Etsy. So they're quite expensive, they're like 14 99 And I was like, is that worth it? But then I was like, you know what? No, let's go for it. Let's go for it. So also on here, I'm gonna collect, grab these two beads off there and put them in with all that. But yeah, no, they're, they're stunning, stunning charms. They are so lovely. Like, oh, I can't, I can't get over this moon. I can't get over this moon with the like flamey feathers and I love it. I think I might get it as a tattoo somewhere. Like genuinely, it's just so pretty. It's just, oh, so pretty. I'm gonna look at all of them once I'm done filming. It's just so pretty. And another thing that I've got it's a cute little spoon. <laughs> it's very, very cute. So I'm gonna ha use this as like a herbal spoon. So like I can grab little herbs, so I can grab herbs out my bags and pop them um, into like my little whatever thing I'm doing really. But look how pretty this is. <laughs> so it has got like flowers 
on it. It's the back. Yeah. It's really pretty. I also got a small surprise witch box, witchcraft box as you can see there. Um, this was £10. It, I only got the small one, you can get them in medium and large. I have a whole other video of unboxing this which will be in the description below. And it was really really cool, I liked all of it. it go check out that video if you want to see it more in depth. So that's it for this video, thank you very much for watching, if you enjoyed it and want more then like and subscribe, yeah. <laughs>